dear students today we will discuss f part of lesson first formation of sentences so have a look at page number 8 all of you f part use capital letter and punctuation marks therefore full stop comma question mark exclamation mark etc at appropriate place in the following passage so you can rewrite here in this way to maintain good health you will need to follow a healthy lifestyle proper diet adequate consumption of water regular exercise sufficient sleep and avoiding stress and some of the factors which can definitely have a positive effect on your health you should also take care of your mental health giving due importance of meditation yoga etc now have a look at page number 9 g part based on the jumbled sentences four sentences are made in each set among the four only one is correct so you all have to tick on correct sentence first one is made speech she boring a what first is she made speech boring a what second she boring a speech what third what a boring speech she made fourth is what a boring speech she made so third is right one what a boring speech she made and put a exclamation mark here so third one is right so we have to put right here tick here second how many brothers and sister you are a how many brothers and sister are you second many brothers and sister how are you third many brothers and sister are you how d brothers and sisters you are how many so the right answer is a how many brothers and sister are you third how many money i should give you a how much money should i give you b how much should i give you money c i should give money how much d i should give money how much to you so first is right one how much money should i give you fourth church a make noise is not is do not the a make a noise in the church do not b do not make a noise in the church c do not make noise in the church d do make noise do make not a noise in the church so the right answer is b part do not make a noise in the church fifth is of very noodles child found this a child found noodles this is of very b child found this noodles is very c the child is very fond of noodles d this is child very fond of noodles so c part is right one this child is very fond of noodles sixth what she a uh, argument have gave stupid a she gave a stupid argument what she gave argument what a stupid c what a stupid argument she gave d what a stupid argument she gave 
So, C is right one. What a stupid argument she gave. Last one is, when the examination will begin. A. When will the examination begin? B. When will the examination begin? C. The examination will begin when? And last one is, the examination will begin when? So, first one, A part is correct. When will the examination begin? Thank you for listening.